Hello and welcome back to the Dundee YouTube channel. My name is David O.C. and today we're joined with this stunning Ford Fiesta. And if you want to see our full review of the Fiesta, you can hit the link up there. As ordinarily on this YouTube channel, that's what we do. We review new cars to the scene, give genuine buying advice. And that's our plan today, to really tap in to the buying advice. So we're going to discuss 10 features that you should make sure that your car has when you're buying a new one. Now, if you'd like to search for new cars for sale, hit the link up there. We've got over 1,000 trusted dealerships nationwide, plenty of selection to choose from. However, let's get in to the 10 items. The first five, these are going to be fundamental. You can't live without. And the second five are kind of more just creature comforts that if you're feeling a little bit lavish, you're going to maybe tick that box and get it in your car. Number one on the list is Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. This means that any Apple phone or Android phone connects up to the screen in front of you here. It's kind of one step further than Bluetooth as you've got all your different apps here on the phone. Spotify plays through it, Google Maps work on it. It is fantastic. You don't even need a car with sat nav anymore. So number one, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. And a little side note, I actually think currently these wires are a little bit dated and in the next four or five years, nearly every car is going to come with wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Number two, and similarly to Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, it comes as standard on nearly every single brand new car and that is cruise control. So here on this little Fiesta, you can set your speed and the car will hold this speed. It just makes motorway driving an absolute breeze. Number three is parking sensors. So when you're reversing into a tight spot around town, these can be crucial. So the closer you get, the closer together the beeping gets. Really, really nice feature. And it can come standard on some cheaper cars, but then in something like a Mercedes, you actually have to pay a little bit extra on some of the models for them. Number four is accident emergency braking system. So generally speaking, there'll be a camera or a sensor here at the front. And what that's doing is, is it's reading the road ahead of you. And let's say the vehicle in front of you puts on its brakes and begins to slow down. At first, it will warn you in the cabin and then it will apply the brakes. Insurance companies love this and will actually give you a slightly lower premium because it does reduce the chance of a low speed collision. And in a lot of cars, it does come as standard. Here in this Fiesta, it's part of a mid autonomous driving package that costs about 920 euro. We'll talk a little bit more about that package later because it has some other features, but that is a big, big plus, And I would say a must have. And number five is a spare wheel. And these are really becoming rare. So hedge your bets. Does this Ford Fiesta have a spare wheel? Let us know in the comments. We'll find out now. It does not. So Ford actually charge 84 euro for a steel spare wheel. In my opinion, that is a must must have and definitely tick that box. So those are five of the essential features that I think cars should have. However, let me know in the comments, what would you think the most essential five are? Now we're gonna talk about five of the kind of creature comforts. These aren't necessarily essential, but are kind of nice features to have within the car. Number one on that creature comfort list is heated seats. This Fiesta doesn't actually have them, but on a cold winter's day, there's nothing nicer. Number two is a reversing camera. Now, on a lot of cars, this is an optional extra. However, it really helps you get your car perfectly in between each side of the lines. You can also see how close things are behind you. But pair reversing camera with parking sensors and you have no excuse for being a bad parker. So number three is blind spot monitoring. Now, 
it's included in this car's extra package that costs 920 euro but it is a really really nice feature it just means you don't have to be looking over your shoulder the whole time you can actually just change lane nice and smoothly and most importantly safely and number four and we spoke about cruise control but adaptive cruise control and again this is part of an upgraded package that we have here in this Ford Fiesta but what it does is it uses that same sensor for accidents avoidance and it basically keeps an equal distance so I can press this button here and I can change the distance between me and the car in front of me but it means when it slows down I slow down and when it accelerates I accelerate very very handy and number five now this one's very bougie but basically if you press this button down here it's gonna scan for a parking spot it's found one so now it's saying please put it in reverse and I shouldn't need to do anything oh my god it's reversing not into the spot that I expected I thought it would choose the bigger one but obviously not oh Oh, no, I can't. I can't go any further back. Oh. Go into first gear. Check the steering wheel out. It's literally magic. Keep going and then it's gonna tell me to stop. Put it back in reverse. Oh, why did it pick such a small spot? There's literally an empty car park here. i tell you what though, that works really, really well. So there you have it, those are 10 features, five that are a must have, and five that are kind of a bit of a creature comfort, but might be worth getting. Personally, I'm a big fan of adaptive cruise control. I just think it makes a long drive so much easier. And I have to say, having a car that parks itself that is a pretty nice party piece. Let us know what some of your favorite features are on modern cars. And if you did enjoy the video, give us a thumbs up, a comment below, and of course, subscribe to the channel. Hit the link up there if you'd like to search for cars for sale in Ireland. We've got over 1,000 trusted dealerships nationwide. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.